Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of LEGO Fortnite. Today it is all about the food. Uh, we got a juicer over there, we got an oven over there, and all this tasty delicious scrub. I'm going to show you some ways where you can basically get endless food. And uh, one of the main ones, things you can do, is assign someone to make food for you. Hey, beat boss, my boy. What you got for me today? That looks pretty tasty. See if he's made anything I selected. Collected stuff from him not too long ago. Oh, he's been working. Boy. Yeah. Dang. So, uh, yeah, assign your different duties and whatever it may be to your villagers. Because the stuff they they can help you out with is kind of OP. Peely, where are you? And uh, if there's something you want uh, two of, make two workstations of the same thing and assign two different villagers to it. Where the freak is Peely, you bum? I also assigned them to food. But another thing you can do is the infinite crop glitch. Go over to crops, just pick a bunch of seeds in the plot. That one only has one, but... You just smack it. This one has 16. This one will be easier to see. Oh. Well, that wasn't supposed to do that. They second, I thought they patched it. Let's see. Yep. Collect all my batteries, and then what you do is you go over to your grain mill. Let's get out of there. What seeds did I get? Corn. Let's do pumpkin. Put whatever one you just harvested in here, and it gives you multiple seeds per fruit. So you're duplicating your seeds basically endlessly. I use a lot of pumpkins for pumpkin pie, so we'll, this is probably the best route. So, yeah, again, uh, two really great ways to get food from assigning your villagers to cook and grow f food for you. They'll do either one, um, and they'll give you a whole slew. Like, it's not just going to just be one thing. You'll get, as you saw from Beef Boss, you'll get... The slurp juices, you'll get slap juices, you'll get snowberry shakes, you'll get pizzas, you'll get grilled corn meat. Who's that over there? Oh, it's Raptor. So, uh, definitely assign one of your villagers to cook food for you. And also, if you want, you can also assign one to grow food for you. You'll just need to have several plots set up so that they can do that with some seeds in them. So, uh, hope this helps you out. Guys, this game is amazing. I freaking love it. So much fun. Let's quickly poop that pot back over there. Oh. There you are, Peely, my man! How's your job? Yeah, give me the slap and the slurp. I just barely assigned him to it, so that's why I didn't get much from but... It's OP! Death to the chicken. Also, if you didn't know, if you want... Uh, certain resources from animals... You can just... I usually use vines, because as I do the infinite harvesting method... You get a bunch of vines from it. And you just collect whatever resource it is, and you slaughter the animal. 
You can also pet them, but petting them only gives you like one of whatever resources you're trying to get, but yeah. Anyways, I keep rambling. I'm going to keep playing. You guys should be playing this game too. And if not, you're just a bum. Ouch! My legs! I see cows. I want the meat. Steak for days! Mm, tasty. 